Luna. I forgot that I pushed the live button, but I'm like... Dude, it's on my computer. Ugh. Ugh. Weird. I'm in. Now we have to reroute the three cents Adele has. All right. Are we we're good? I I have. I have water, I have coffee, I have clean cool clothes on, I'm wearing pants. I believe the music is audible. I think we're good to go. Three, five. Woo! All right, and we went we went to the the pool store, the local pool shop, and I was like, you know, we we've got this pool, and I think we um I don't know what chemicals to get, but I know we have to worry about like algae and ph and blah 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 and i gave her the information just came back with this one bowl and she's like just use one cap of this once a week i was like ah okay <laughs> okay so my hair i was like building up this like really big expensive process and it was literally just like a 20 dollar bottle of chemical that'll last for ages <laughs> so yay Hi, Doris. I have not heard back from Benny Fiber. But. We don't know. Yeah, the, uh, the account that I, I showed you the picture of, Disobey, they're like a, a PR kind of agency for gaming and they're always doing posts like you know shoot your shot who's a brand you really want to work with and i'm like you know what so i finally learned her i finally sent a message to beanie fiber and it was i i beard i was almost like i sparkle um Yeah, no pump. Beanie fiber. <laughs> so I I wrote this like very like two paragraph introduction and I was like, that sounds a bit stilted, but my brain's not working. So uh, I fired up the old chat GPT and uh, it was perfect. So we we shall see. But yeah, I reached out to Benny Viper today, uh, seeking out interest in a collaboration. Um. So what I did say was, although I'm not a health health influencer per se, I do believe I can contribute by introducing your brain to the gaming and live streaming community. Many of us in the industry lead sedentary lifestyles and often neglect our diets. I'm eager to collaborate with your brand to spread the word and potentially enhance the streaming experience to my fellow gamers. Let's make those bathroom breaks a thing of the past.
Yeah. I I didn't put that in there. I'll, I'll save that for uh, for when when I get a relationship built. Um. But it's true. Lots of streamers have terrible diets. So. I didn't want to mention things being like tapping a new audience because you know when you're talking about poop you don't really want to think to use analogies to do with taps i don't feel um, so yes so we we've got we have the pool chemical that we need the one pool chemical that we need so we still need to get a tarp to go under it to stop the grass coming up um and we need a bit of sand or gravel Preferably sand to like level the ground underneath the pool um, and a cover, but we're pretty much set. I'm pretty excited about this now. <sighs> oh. I, I'm pretty excited about me. Honestly, until... <laughs> it sounds delicious. I'm, I'm telling you. Tablespoon of fiber in my coffee every day. And I am pooping so much better than I used to. I used to frequently have to get up from stream because I'd have an upset tummy and it doesn't happen very often now. At least I eat lots of like cheesy broccoli vegetable soup. We don't talk about that stream though. Um I haven't got any news back from Bluefang, our server provider. Um, other than that, they are still looking into it. Apparently they did a while ago. And so they're just like going back and having a look, but it's not to do, the reason they don't have vintage service store, a vintage story service is not because the game isn't on Steam. Cause I was like, is, is that a thing? And they're like, no, it makes it easier, but no, that's not a reason. So it's it's not a no. Oh, and also the Nebraska DLC for American Truck Sim is due out on the week of the anniversary streams. So that's good timing. So I might, I'm not sure, but I might email them and be like, Anniversary stream, ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, I still have a bunch of base game, but maybe, maybe they have some DLC bundles they want to share. We will see. I did lots of really boring for me email bullshit today, and then I ate sushi, so everything was fine. I ate too much sushi. I, I. I I ate way too much sushi, but it was delicious. Yes, me too. I see, we've got Vintage Story, and then we've got the complete edition of Conan Exiles to give away. Those are our two big ones. Um, but I have a bunch of other keys. I still don't know the structure of what I'm doing for that. I probably need to come up with that soon. I feel like we should leave the big giveaways until like the 24 hour stream though, just as something to like keep keep me hyped up. But, but we'll see. Uh, so I'm going to keep on talking. Wait, there was a mod that I was talking about yesterday. Oh, skills. X skills. It was one that I noticed I was missing. Let's get that going before. The X skills. I'm pretty sure it's with the skills. Skills is, yeah. I mean, I don't know that I'm going to get a lot out of it in single player, but. The way I figure it, I'm, I'm kind of getting a balance. I feel like I'm sort of testing getting a feel for balance of mods for just in case we do get the opportunity to have this vintage story server. Um, so, 
Is... Is the music audible? How are we audio levels? Wait. I can't not ask. I have to. It's okay for me? You hear it? Okay. I noticed in some of my clips that it was like quite loud. And then like yesterday it was like really quiet. So I was like, Ugh. I found a... Uh, Okay, awesome. Thank you, Luna. Wait, so you're not playing Planet Crafting? Um, I found these YouTube playlists that are like 12 hours of... Oh, all right, sure. Like 12 hour playlists of copyright free music, apparently. Or at least I haven't had any videos who've used these playlists get flagged on YouTube. Oh. Object reference not set. <laughs> well, the game crashed. That's a good start. Ew, don't do that. Oh, that's terrible. The video for the playlist is like... So X libs, X girls. Okay, let's see if it works. So by the end of stream last night, we had a copper pickaxe and a copper hammer. Um, and we had some stuff planted, so we were kind of thinking, like, food acquisition. I think I had a bunch of meat in my inventory. Thankfully... We're in single play, you don't have to worry about things going off. It's having a bloody good thing. Mind you, I guess X skills probably makes a pretty big change to the game too. Okay, so we have a candle. Okay, I need to turn, for me, I need to turn the music down and the game up. I don't know if the game is audible right now. Alright, what have I got? I got a bunch of berries. Oh, that's right, I made this like meat fish black currant stew and it like was like a really good stew. Hey! Where did all my garden go? What the heck? Oh. I know what happened. 
You fuckers. It's my own fault. I bet what happened is Jackass Drifter went into the fire and then bumped into the fence. And then all my crops burned. I bet. I, it wasn't, I only had a few things planted. It's not a, not a big concern, really. Yeah. It seems weird because when I logged out, everything was fine. But, uh, things happen. A fire safe yeah I think we do have to have a fire safety meeting or I could just you know oh there's a lot of them look at them all two three four five six there's 10. At least 10. But yeah, I mean, I I, I put that there, aware that that could be a risk. I am second guessing, like, you can't get rid of the surface drifters, right? That's just a thing. Pretty sure. Okay, well. We can extend the garden into the water. My head's like, dar, dull, you need to restart. You lost your dandelions, you should restart. Makes no sense. I turned on lore content, which is, I think, the thing that gives you the drifters. So that I have uh, the traders and the ruins. I believe Toast could speak to that more than I could, but I think that's what the deal is there. All right, we'll do it this way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the law, which makes sense because, uh oh, um, if you have the traders, then you need the uh, you need the coins, right? The gears. This bear is doing all the hunting for me. I am super tempted though to like first start. Hey buddy. Hi. He's a pretty girl. Yes, you are. And I kind of love not having anyone around. <laughs> it's it's, it's kind of terrible. 
I don't know. I mean, I spent so much time yesterday, but I was just like fucking around. What do we reckon? It's not like I have a huge amount of progress. Push me. Oh. Now I'm thinking of it in terms of like prepping. But what I can oh, you know what? I had a brain. A waffle house what are you gonna call it? Waffle horse? Waffle house? Wait, oh, right. No, that's right. I remember. So what is this one? Exploration. So what's the difference then between going exploration? Homo sapiens and then adding a little content. Oh yeah, food spoilage rate 50%, hunger rate 50%. Oh hi Ali. Right, let's try this again. I don't know, should I use the same seed? That's, that's the setting that got us last time. Hello there. Uh, I think you should go for that. I don't. I, have, I don't have the backpack mod on the save. Um, good story. The AB something. I even got the player corpse mod because I've got the keep inventory content. It does the same thing, but doesn't it? Basically, except you don't have to go and pick up the bits. I just, I don't enjoy corpse runs at all. Um, but the backpack one, definitely. Yeah.
Oh, this is this is what got me last time. I see there to be. Wait, what was that by default? There was something that I was like, what was the setting that I was mentioning yesterday? Yeah, no, there was another one. Uh, you're right. There was that one, but there was something else. Haven's disabled. Block gravity is just sand and gravel. I wish I could just disable that altogether, to be honest. Okay. Am I going to use the same seed? Because it was a pretty good start. But then another one could be better. Okay, someone give us a seed to start off with. It doesn't matter. We're just going to spend all day trying to find Clopper again, but that makes me happy. We have done croissant before, but not with these settings. The last one was Bumblebee. Or I could just keep it random. Not the bees? Okay. Poop? We'll try poop next time. Post. Warm. Okay. Don't need that. Quasle. Um. I disabled the class recipes, didn't I? Yeah. We don't want those. I say we. Because doesn't that mean every, if I disable it, doesn't it mean that I can make any of the recipes? I thought they said froggy cave belly. Okay, we're going to call it not the bees. Yeah. No class here. We'll have none of that class stuff. So this is potentially a practice run for a gentle community server, which will make it a bit more inclusive for some of our friends who, who aren't uh, good at doing the combat. Dad, did you how late did you stay up last night playing Hades? Or Empire Survivors. No, V Rising. There's too many V games. Everyone's like VS. I'm like, what? Vampire Survivors? Vintage Story? Acronyms are a terrible idea. Vintage Rising? Good job taking care of you. Hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Side, no, not side run, wait, side fence. It's so cute! Ravi! <laughs> Ravi! Must have... Smirk. Alright, my favorite hair color is liver. <sighs> Why? Why 
is there one in the air? I don't I don't even know the context on no context on most of them. I don't I don't know. I I don't know, Ali. Okay. So let's just save. <laughs> no, no context. None of that. Ow. Heck. Well, I got myself there, huh? Distance getting the, uh... Versus you knowing how to use things. Why is this not doing anything? Hello? Oh, there we go. Yeah, because Buckman had to make a search function. How rude. I can't even remember how this one works. Flowers. Oh, so it turns out all we needed, Ali, is one chemical. That's it. This one. Yeah, I went in. <laughs> it's poor. This poor girl at the uh, counter, and I was like, hey, we've just got to pull, and it's a thousand gallons, and it's 10 feet wide, and it's made of this material, and it's built in this particular way, and I know I need something for pH levels and algae, and she's like, hang on a second, and then she came back, and she's like, this is the stuff, just put one cap in every week. And I'm like, what about, like, algae, and she's like, one cape of this a week. <laughs> I was like, oh my. She was like, oh my god. Um, so it's sodium dichloro S tri triazine trione dihydrate. It's just granulated. Yeah. And then she gave me a little bottle to if I need to do a test. So I was like, ooh, free urine test. Exciting. Yeah. It's basically, she said, with the the volume of the pool, literally just like it's, it's, it's literally just spa shop. Um once a week we'll do it. Just, we don't need a pump or anything. That's it. Hello, this is hey. Funky Pink Cow. Whoever you are, whatever your pronouns, you're valid and loved by this community. Please take time now to care for yourself by hydrating, medicating, caffeinating, urinating, or otherwise participating in some act of self-maintenance. Take care of yourself. Thank you, Toast. I can't believe you're talking about my TDS on stream. <laughs> um, I don't know what that is. What is TDS? Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Because it is, we are making a solution every time we add the granules into the water. Quick dissolving concentrated chlorinating granular.
Yeah. So it was it was pretty good. So that was like twenty bucks. I don't know what the volume of the lid is, but if it's one lid a week, it looks like we've got at least ten weeks worth in there. And now I know what we need. I can just order it online. So, but yeah, this this poor woman was just like looking at me, and her eyes were going crossed as I was info dumping. It's fine. It is her job. I also made a deliberate concerted effort because she looked young. I didn't want to be condescending. So instead of saying, I'd like to talk to someone about this, I was just like, hey, can you help me? Because I, I don't want to be a condescending Karen. And she was like, I don't know, but I can go find out for you. And I was like, that is the perfect interaction right there as far as I'm concerned. I hear a chicken. All right, so now I have to remember how to start again. But yeah, I don't want to be a condescending carrot. Nothing worse than having a condescending carrot in your pocket. I want to pick up granite. Hi. Oh, thank you. It's actually the color isn't showing accurately at all. But, but thank you. It's actually like a pale purple. That's weird. Oh, I know. Actually, there. There. I have a bunch of color correction filters for different clothes now. You're like, my wife likes color of my shirt, and I'm like, cool, thanks. Now I'm going to change it. I don't mean it like that. Yeah, it is. It still didn't really take. It's like one of like a bunch of bees. Maybe it's still a bit more pinker. I don't know. It was just like a bunch of t-shirts that I got from. They had them on sale at Walmart like three dollars a piece so i just grabbed one one in each color like two years back um i don't know if it has oh these cat tails i don't know if it has a name it is, it is more purpley. It's not light blue at all. <laughs> but yeah, I found that like some colors on the webcam just need a little bit more help than others. I forget. 
Oh, you know what? I should get some grass too. I forgot to edit the uh, file for the path mod. There's one that it, you can edit the JSON for it and it'll stop yelling. Well, I mean, it doesn't yell, but when you run over t squares and it it gets rid of the crunch sound, the grass cutting cusp sound. My all my monitors have a slightly different color. Cause it looks like bang on. sit there and mess around with my t-shirt colors now probably looks no different to everyone else but it's not the point So rainy. It's gonna get rainy here this evening. There is there is the possibility that we might lose power because that storm front that Ali had yesterday is coming through near us. I don't think it's gonna be too bad here though. It's, the air is so thick out there though. It's just like really heavy. I feel happier now that I've got this world loaded, knowing that I've got better ruins and, you know, primitive survival and everything already, like, into the game. I feel like having that all, like, set to start off with is probably a bit more healthy for the game.
I know I need more. So I didn't delete the game that I was on before, so if I end up not liking this one... You're okay. I know I'm gonna need cord or... What I need for crap. We're gonna have to get out of the uh, area with the redwoods because I can't chop a redwood tree. Two, three. All right, so now we need that. That makes a torch. I need some more sticks. I can make a fire starter. Starter. Dead. Oh, well, I guess I can plant a birch. Birch, please. Plant. I suppose I could use granite. I just end up with like too many types of rocks in my inventory. Nine logs. Oh, it's not that bad. No. It's definitely an interesting starting location, but oh my god, the rain. Alright. It'll be much easier to uh, Get the exploring done if I get this raft made. All 
right so it's like that and then that gets me a raft ow oh not ow how did that not hurt You and the air. Make another knife. Which way am I going? Oh god. It's pretty warm here. Is it 6.30? Well, it's, uh... Oh, that was granite. Too early to go to bed. But it's bloody dark. There's a traitor. So if we aim down this way, then we can potentially pick up some copper on the way. So let's go east. Oh god, it's so dark. It's, it's totally fine. Everything is fine. Oh, we've got a biome change. Oh, the sky's clearing. All right, what's this over here? This looks interesting. It's just it's like a entrance, but I can use it to. Oh, well, hello. Dry spot so I can set up my torch. Okay, now the storm clouds have cleared.
Well, that was close. Hey, the bunnies are exposing clay. Wait, we have ads starting in about 30 seconds. So, and, ooh. Hello? Are you trying to stand up? Yep, stretch, hydrate. Hello! Hi, Carter! Oh. Ooh, that made my head spin. I don't know if it's still not really wait go an hours. Okay. Oh wait. My head broke has it This one is always out of whack. Still can't see. <clears throat> I keep on listening out for that um rift sound, which I'm not gonna hear. Oh, that's odd, Ali. Uh, channel point. I stream Twitch. I'm alive. I don't know, it seems to me only your viewers can contribute. Aunties. Available when the channel is live. Yeah, I see that error message too. I'm pretty sure I'm live. I mean, I'm, I might not be. Maybe I'm just talking to myself again. <laughs> Definitely live, but also a little bit dead. I mean, everyone I know who has like community goals. I've been finished. So I don't know if it's just a Twitch thing or
Yeah. Twitch be twitchy. There's something I want to go get over here. I'd really well, it's so weird when it switches. I'd quite like the sun to come up. If we could arrange that, that would be great. I'm so ready for these nails to be gone. And I can't just like pull them off. I need a proper solvent for them. Hello, I can't see anything. Yes, run to the lightning. That's a good idea. I'm trying to remember to pick up any flint that I run over just so I can have it on hand for. This is a very curious place. Oh, hello. Loose meteoric pieces. I'm so never coming back here, but I'll mark it. Jesus Christ. Very bright. Now I'm second guessing myself in terms of like, what have I done to make material placement harder for myself? It looks like some ruins ahead. We are defying gravity as well. We ain't having any of that gravity bullshit. Floating rocks, hell. Yeah. Here we go. Copper. Oh, it's actually marking copper now, so I don't need to do it.
That is one of the nice things about running around on these deserts. It's so much easier to find materials. This is just the contrast of the, the shiny, shiny. Even o'clock in the morning, we don't need that out. We don't need the torch. That is over there. Light building materials trader. Yum. exciting. Uh, uh, wait, where's? But also it looks like there's a ruin over there. Yeah. Maybe, probably not that. Maybe that, and probably that. It's very sulky. Yeah, that's definitely some ruins. Copper? Oh, they've got Ashlar pots. Maybe there's just like. Ooh. I don't have a shovel, but. Clearly, we have to go in here. But I should dig some dirt first so I can get out. Oh, that's sand. Fuck the sand. Right, 
like, we're gonna find something amazing in here, I have decided. Oh, that wasn't smart. And now I fight. There's still a water source block in here somewhere. There we go. That was a pain in the ass. That was uneventful. So I did get uh aunts. So that's going to be a nice starter. I was kind of vaguely hoping. That there might be like an immediately visible break phase somewhere. Fine. 
Where am I going? Well, that looks like it could be something. That also a thing? That's the thing now. Beta Ruins has spoiled me for Vanilla Ruins. There's like some mods where I, I don't... I don't think I want to play without now. Which is fine. Alright, so that's that. What is this over here? Uh, viaduct? Aqueduct? Seeds? I don't really need seeds yet. Cabbage seeds fine. I'll take I'll take cabbage seeds. Tools, make sure. Hmm. Oh, there's a book. I don't know what that did. I ate the book though. All right, well, I have an extra shovel. And an extra axe. Bamboo? Is that bamboo? Not interested in bamboo. Heathers? for that either okay let's go southwest
They're getting more cooler. I need to see one point eight two. Oh god, I can't see now. Alright, there we go. for an area that doesn't have much sort of variation in topography immediately but something kind of interesting nearby why does this this looks really weird to that was lit lit at that side. Hmm. Oh, I felt like that ought to be something significant. Alright, let's go south. Maybe I'll lock out and find some Ruins with like good tools or something. Slayed, right? Some straight lines on a lake around the corner here. See? Get to it. Darius Lake. Darius Lake. Want to get close to you? I can't. Well, that's only happening if I can climb up there somehow. Oh. 
Are us? Like, what if it's really cool in there? What if it's so far down? I can't actually see. And I get stuck there forever and ever. What if there's literally nothing down there? Which is what it's beginning to look like. It'd be great if there was, you know, climbing. Oh. And for a penny, I guess. Wait, what? Why am I leaving sparkles behind me? Is that purple? Ah. Huh. So, so much attention I pay. <laughs> Spark, I think, think it's very helpful, thank you. Well, that was exciting. Okay, waste. Okay. I thought maybe I was fighting magical glitter or something. No. Not even a little bit. Twenty seven degrees, seven o'clock at night. Oh, it's like Florida. Finding a lot of lead around, which is nice.
feel like this area here to the west has some potential. But bloody dark. I can't see. This just doesn't really help. So I learned yesterday with this path mod, it's customizable, but by default, if you cross over the same area it's like three, three or four times, it adds a, a new block, a wilderness trail block. Um, and I don't know what the recovery time on it is, but like you can't hoe it or anything. But you can change how many passes it takes before that block is made and some other things too. So that's how you end up with these paths. Quite interesting. Well, the neighbors are out doing the lawns again in the rain. Time is it? Eight eight thirty. It's still too early. If I go to bed now, it will be. 30. 9 30 is like the the earliest I can go to bed wake up to daylight I don't know if I'm hearing thunder or not. Is it point redemption unlocked yet? Because I'm live. Well, we don't have a tornado watch anymore, so that's a bonus. I don't know how to fix my channel point redemption not working. Very cozy in here. Forty-five. Right. Oh, look, what a surprise. It's still raining. 
rainfall in this area almost all of the time. Fucking redwood trees, man. Cranberries. Agriculture. Pink. Well, this seems like a nice, easy source for brown coal. I'll take it. Well, I'll mark it. Ooh, this could be something interesting. I th I think this is the bit that I enjoy. <laughs> Maybe the the exploring and like the looking for the place to sit down. the accumulation of stuff. Birch trees. Rainfall in this area still almost all of the time. There's a couple of clusters of ruins around here that could be interesting. It's got a roof. It's just straight cords, right? Sure. 
Hopefully your internet was working today. <gasps> You're doing Deirdrop style? Hi, Summer. Hello. Hey. It's cats all over my game. <laughs> Thank you for the raid wine, Soma. Thank you for the tangia. I hope you had fun. Been getting into it? Awesome. I'm so glad. Oh, welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. Um, hello, I'm Del Deliria. My pronouns are she, her, and I've just found this rather ominous looking ruin in a cave. And I have to break this skull to get in. Sometimes, sometimes things align perfectly with Deirdrop and it's just like, oh hell yeah. So, I, I just, we just found this. I don't know what's in here. Thanks for, oh. Hey buddy, you can just go here. Good, good job. What is this place? Cause that's not alarming. Ooh. Uh, is it is it that that's it that's replacing oh that's kind of cute though heavily worn that's still better than what i've got hey ex excuse you Buddy? My god, there's a bunch of storage crates over there. Children's toys? Oh my god. What? Ooh, a book. I want to look at these. Um, um, um. All right, hang on. Uh, did I? Yeah, I need to swap that out. Oh, I can't. All right. I just want to, I want to put this up higher so I can see it. My god, look at all these containers. Oh, that's really cute. Forage, farming, food tool. Chalk? Correct granite. 
What is that? Ceiling hook? Stone. Nothing in there. Quartz chunk. Rusty gears. Shelves. This is kind of cool. Except for, you know, the bodies. Ooh, what's in there? Charcoal. Oh, is that their charcoal pit? That's so cool. Okay, well, that was a place. And that is under here which makes it a little alarming oh this is huge <gasps> oh my gosh do we need to reclaim this house it's got like a window and like roofing and a fire pit wait what else is there here oh dear these people had a bad day Like a real bad day. Aged wooden slabs. <gasps> oh, it's ruined. I was like, oh my god, a bucket? Yes. Ah. All right, what what is going on here? Hello. Oh, plaster. Hey, there's. We just found this like ruins complex that was kind of scary. Oh, oh, it's got a bed and some carpet. Some blasting powder. What was in there? So there's been, like a bunch of materials. Is that this big old house? I'm really sad that that bucket is ruined. I was pretty excited about the potential for a bucket. Is <gasps> a quern.
I think we gotta mark this. Screw it. Damn. I was like, oh, X? No, never mind. I feel like so far, like these are a settings that are working out well. So if they are, I'll save them. Oh, hey, that's the same format as last time. I don't know why that's not opening. I don't think it's got anything in there, so maybe. I think the bunny was checking me out. What's that? Oh, we want to go to the southeast, but also I want to see what that is. I think that's just gravel. Ow. Um, my, my community point redemption is broken and I don't know how to fix it. It's just gravel. I'm open to suggestions. It, <laughs> it, it seems to think I'm not live. Which, you know, pretty sure I am. Flint, Flint is like that. Why? For some reason, Tick just doesn't like him. It, I mean, is it? Are you imagining me or am I imagining you? Oh god, it's 30 degrees. This is too hot for spring. Also too hot for turnips. I mean... Oh uh, yeah, I'm going on there. Oh, all right. That's interesting. I like that you use that phrase and I kind of knew what you meant. More kids toys? No potsheads. Wait, wait, that's dirt.
her. I can't remember which button. My inventory hurts. Yeah, I'm curious about Flint because I we can we can literally we can do exactly the same things. Oh, yes, but. His stuff just does weird shit. All right, let me go over here. I don't need those. Two copper sides. I don't need copper sides right now. But since 200 copper, I don't have to worry about getting it a later time. Oh. Heck. this over here I'm very pleased to have two of these I could eat the grain What is that? Is that a ruin? Oh, I wonder if it's one of the Macropolis type ones. Okay, that's jungle right there. So that means peanut land. Goodbye. I love those golden poppies. Oh, well, never mind. It vanished, so I guess it was just a weird artifact. Okay, fine. We'll go back this way. I swear it's it it hasn't stopped raining since I started playing this today. I I know it has. It doesn't feel I'm curious how the rainfall thing is figured out. I'm assuming it's tied to client the uh, 
the buyer. Thing is, what I want is a really nice, pretty, lush green area where it doesn't rain. <laughs> but you kind of need the rain to have the pretty green lush, you know? The two kind of go hand in hand. Raining party. Well, hey. Everyone's invited today. Rex. Hello. Hi. Thank you for the raid. Oh, hi, Drax. Everyone, come on. Come on by. Come on in. Get comfy. Grab a copper and a snack. Uh, thank you for the raid. And uh, welcome in. Hello. Hi, Abe. Uh, well, I... I restarted? Which is weird, because, you know, there's nothing that goes wrong. <laughs> oh, Luna, I'd love to see a picture. Stick! Yeah, I don't know. I kind of logged in and then I realized that a couple of mods that I wanted to try weren't loaded up. And I, I feel like... Oh, I thank you. I, I I feel like getting all the, the big so mods loaded on server creation helps. Um, And then uh, I realized that a drifter basically burned all my crops down. And I was like, well, I wasn't super excited about where I was anyway, so... Yeah. Yeah, I drifted, like... You know, I set a fire, and the drifter crawled through it, and I think what happened is basically the drifter crawled through the fire and then, like, into the grubs. Kind of acted like the opposite of making a protector fire line. But I didn't really lose much. But it felt like a, you know, time to reload. So this time I made sure I've got better ruins loaded and I've got primitive survival and yeah. And welcome in, by the way. I, I keep forgetting. Um, but hello, hi, I'm Dal. Valeria, my pronouns are she, her, and I'm just faffing around on a single player Vintage Stories over. I don't even know what I'm looking for at this point. No, I wasn't that far along. I had like, uh, I had a copper pickaxe and a copper hammer, but I just found a ruin and now I've got a copper pick, two hammers, uh, two sides and two forges. Uh, two sconces. So basically that's where I was on the last one except without the sconces. Oh. Oh, that's weird. Did I... wonder if I did something wrong. Chepsy is per... I don't see it in mine either. Tricks. I see that it's in your channel. But I don't see it in mine either. I think there's something weird going on because my... Oh, that's so 
pretty Luna. Um, my community points goal is not detecting that I'm live. Oh no, I see it. I see it now. I don't... I don't know. It wasn't a very exciting fire. Honestly, I was very tempted by the first one. But then I realized that it could get misconstrued for other things and I didn't want to play that game. Oh. <laughs> I was like... No. No, I, I don't think I want that. <laughs> Especially knowing how saucy my chat gets. Oh, no, I'm good. Um, yeah, I don't know. It was it literally wasn't showing on it until then. Until I like opened the the BTTV page. Blue beans. Is it late enough? It's almost late enough for me to go to bed and wake up and be able to see the next. So I want to try and find a place that's a little bit cooler than where I said last time because there's lots of like wild turnips but there's no um why am I it, it was too hot to plant turnips carrots and I just want some variety you know I may wake up dead from this. Possibly. Nope, oh, okay. I've fallen to sleep before with a torch in my hand and woken up burning to death. It's blue clay. Holy crap, there's a lot of blue clay around here. I'm trying to find an interesting place to build. With ocean access. I don't know why I'm being so picky, because I never stay where I first build. Trader? We just found like a really neat ruin that was half sort of sunk into the ground, which made it seem like very ominous, especially because I couldn't get into the ruin without moving a skeleton. Right. I don't know, I mean, there's something about starting afresh that just, just really likes starting out again. Yeah. Just a little bit dead though. Well, actually, no, he was very dead because he was. Yeah. All the potential. 
He, he was very dead. There was, there was, there was just a skeleton. <laughs> Wine's like, oh, okay. Glass trader. I've not seen this before. Yeah, it was very ominous. There were a bunch of like straw beds on. Excuse you. Straw beds on the floor and uh, children's toys. Oh, I should see what he has because there's some some fingers down there. Wait. Ugh. It was. I'm just gonna. Look, I don't need that. Hey, buddy. Hey. Delirey one skinny love delirey. Jizzy. Delirey one skinny love love you. Friend. <laughs> I love, I love what Jinx was speech does to that. Hey, thank you. Thank you so much for your support. It means a lot. It's been so long. Do you have a color preference? So far, I've just been using pink. Pink for you and dark blue. It's been, it's literally been 84 years. Jesse's like, one of the the people that I've known for the longest on Twitch. <laughs> oh, it's working! Sadie fixed it. <laughs> Ooh, that's a pretty purple. All right, perfect, per perfect. Sadie, thank you for fixing. I don't know what you did. Perfect. Jesse Purple. So it, it must be. But yeah, get get your get your points in there. Oh, I hope so you're well today, Jesse. I've been enjoying your pictures of all the like the new food places that you've been going on Instagram. Oh, swerve it. Thank you. Wow, look at all this colored glass and stuff. Hey, dude, you're pushy. Like, he just swore at me. He literally just said, fuck you. What a jerk. Well... I messaged I messaged Dean yesterday. If 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 the, we can arrange some co coordination um with M and, and Sadie and maybe it's completely out of my head like it, it's then yeah, possibly. Hey, thank you. I would lo I would love to um, come and visit you guys so much. I think it would be an absolute blast. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, M's M's family, um is not too far north of well i mean relatively speaking not too far north of me um, which is how they came to visit last time so it's possible that sadie might be able to um kidnap me it's just the return trip that could be potentially it has to be a return trip you can't just keep me up there um, but yeah, we can potentially, if we have our people talk to, to our other people, oh, after, after your trip to, to Ireland though, that's what I was thinking. 
That's what Dean mentioned. You need to go to Sarasota. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe we need to make a, a group chat to try and like coordinate things. And I say we, I'm literally, I, I'm just the... <laughs> I, I'm just the cargo at this point being shipped from one person to another but that might make it easy to try and coordinate if it's something that you're all well into I'm I'm in it I've already told Flint that I could potentially you know be out of town and he's like well you can't get on a bus without ID and I'm like well that's a truth but it's, there's ways and means I don't know where I'm going. Let's wait, we're going this way. I still don't know what I'm doing. So, so. Yes. Look, Ali, Sadie fixed it. <laughs> yes! Oh yeah, that would be fun. Are we not? What? Oh, I locked I locked my Discord down because I was having some issues. So -so. Thanks, Jesse. <laughs> Sadie. Yeah, I was having issues with a whole lot of spam. And I so I, I locked it down, but I think I locked it down too hard, and I don't know how to fix it because I'm such a professional. Oh, thank you. It was like something... Oh, I just put my torch out. He can heck her. You can name it what you like. Um, I, d I didn't mean to like push or anything. I just figured like if this was going to be a potential thing, it might be easier to just sort of information share in, in one place rather than me blathering on Discord when I don't know what I'm saying half the time. A channel in Discord probably would have, in uh, one of the Discords would have worked, but that works. Good, good job, Sadie. M's like, what's going on? Why is my wife inviting me to random groups? Ooh, ooh, I just, I see a fir tree. I'm gonna have a whole lot of anxiety, by the way. Yeah, I would possibly. Like, I will be pretty, pretty anxious because. I've, I used to travel everywhere by myself, um, but I haven't gone anywhere in, I haven't had any agency and gone anywhere by myself in over a decade, so yeah. I forgot how to be independent. Chickens! Yeah. Actually, I, as, I think I'll be more comfortable 
traveling with friends than using public transport because I am scared of law enforcement <laughs> on the idea of law enforcement on public transport. I mean, considering how much we were blathering when you were visiting last time, I don't think we're going to notice if there's anything else. Oh, I'm not worried about that. I've I've just trained myself to uh, to be a home a homebody out of necessity, so it's gonna be a whole thing. I'm not I'm not worried about it, but just an advisory thing. Yeah. Like when I lived in England, I'd frequently just, you know, like pack a backpack and like an overnight bag and then just take off and get on the next train and see where I ended up. Well, I have to go down here. Okay, no, I don't. No, I'm good. Wait, where am I going? Oh, I wanted to try and go north. I'm going the very opposite direction that I wanted to go. But no, like, I get separation anxiety now if I'm, like, away from home for, like, two hours. So. But usually that's because I haven't been involved or, like, actively consented in it. It's been, like, something that's sort of thrown on me last minute. So I feel like it'll be different this time. You finally filled... Yike, your, your giant, uh, fancy upgraded ones. <sighs> I have to try and do that on the server at some point. At least once. Hey, why is my, why is that doing that? Better. My green screen keeps acting so screwy. It used to be fine. And I don't know if it's just my E lights are lower or something, but all of a sudden I now need like extra lighting for them to my green screen to work. I'd rather have the bright ones behind me anyway. I very nearly decided to get rid of the green screen. I love I do love it though, because then I don't have to tidy my room. <laughs> I can just like yeah. Well, this could be a nice. Should we go ashore here? This is nice and green. Oh, let's go around the coast right there. I want a nice. A place with a nice coastal approach. Oh, that 
that's a pretty picture that Eco posted. This this is what I miss from the place that I have on the server. Like the variation in green. The jungle is great for the heat and the lack of bears and wolves. But I I do miss the tonal changes. I am gonna eat the fuck out of that turnip. Mmm, delicious. I I did a Drax and put my torch out. Um, so that's fine. This is probably fine, right? Oh, I can't see. No. Mm -mm. I, don't, I don't like it when I can't see. Thirty-two. It's getting warmer. What the heck? Apples? It's everywhere I go, it's raining. Oh, it's more bloody redwood, that's why. Surely. Surely we're gonna find... I'm not looking for the perfect spot. I'm just looking for... the perfect spot. Like, I'm not super picky, I'm just like super picky. So I found out with this, um, this path mod that there's actually a new block type. So every time you walk over a block, it changes state, and eventually it turns into this like tamped down earth called a wilderness trail. Which is visible very clearly on the map. I think it does recover by itself. But that's how you end up with the trails being made, because otherwise the soil does recover. But yeah, I was like, I noticed it yesterday. I'm I'm very excited by this mod. I think it's a really clever idea and I keep on waffling on about it. I do kind of worry about being away from stream for like a couple of weeks and I'm sure it'll be fine but I'm just like Every everyone's gonna everyone's gonna unsubscribe and unfollow and they're all gonna leave me and I'm not gonna have any friends 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 I meant to say friends bring my key I could that's true uh, yeah, of course, because Dean's will set up for streaming. Is this is this something that that may actually come about? Hey, 
Hello, friendo. Much love. Ego. Hello. Eco, that picture you posted is so pretty. Eco, thank you. What color would you like? I'm guessing green. <laughs> what? what, what? Am I not turtle enough <laughs> for the turtle club? Yellow? He was keeping me on my toes. Okay. Eco. Yellow. Okay. Hey, stop shoving me, jerk! These merchants are so rude. Um, I started a new game, Echo, but on single player, just to sort of uh it, it, in i don't know i don't want to say easy easy mode but like no aggressive critters basically and a few other settings just to like make it a bit more comfy but when i'm having a low spoon to can't even open the spoon drawer kind of day oh lord It sounds it just the the color like the lighting it must be so nice to take those pictures as well with your new phone so i'm so glad that you're you're all set up yeah all spoons in the dishwasher oh i said something like last week about all my spoons stuck in the drawer you know there's always that like drawer where you try to open it and like the potato masher stops the drawer from being able to open properly or like the funnel or something just jams and you can't even get to the goddamn spoons <laughs> that, that's kind of where i was yesterday it's like i can see the spoons I can touch the spoons, but I can't get to the spoons. Don't know where I'm going. This way. Going this way. Oh, I just realized I don't have any backup food. Away. You are doing some hard work, Echo friend. Sweet. Okay. Oh, also, um, Mushrooms. Um, there's a few more uh, sponsored streams that we can pick from. I didn't want to info dump on you on everyone at, at once, but there's a few games that we can pick from for the next that are kind of like the pirate one that we did last month. Um, so I'll, I'll post a screenshot in Discord later. I think I've figured out a, a better way of managing the sponsored stream stuff, the sponsored game stuff in Discord without it getting too spammy, which is what I was very concerned about. I, I don't want anyone to get like... Oh, 
overdone with seeing sponsored stuff. But I think I figured it out. Oh. Should probably mark that. Oh, they didn't pop out. Oh, coal, coal. Here? Brown coal. It's it's dark. Um I do have a fire starter, but I don't know if I can start my torch in the rain. I suppose I could just like that. Oh, well that's instantly better. Oh, fucking ants. They're just they're such jerks. <laughs> yeah, it's, there's something with like strong smells that mark that sort of marks the trail or blocks the trail that they use. Strong smelling things often work well for that sort of stuff. And lavender's lovely to have inside too. For a while there, I had, had lavender and lemongrass and penny royal and basil. Sorry, basil. Um, and little pots plant pots um, around the doors and it does help with preventing bugs coming in. I got rid of the penny royal just for safety but the others all just kind of died off. Oh god he scared the shit out of me. What? Oh, it's too early to go to bed still. Where are we in relation to... I think this is like where we started, right? 21 degrees. I feel like this... So I started, as, started this game off in the warm zone, I think. We went to the pool shop today and I was asking, I was so stressed about all the different chemicals and things that we would need to try and manage our swimming, the swimming pool that Flynn's mom got for us. And uh, we left with one bottle to do deal with everything. And I was like, well, okay then. <laughs> I guess it's fine. We're just going to eat some uh, raw rice. Yummy. It's a pud! Pud pud! Hi pud! Oh lord, everyone's... oh! Alright. Please don't be scary dark. Aw, oh, you're being scary dark. 
Don't like it. Chocolate. Oh, <gasps> yum. You did a good job. It was a very noble sacrifice that you made, but good for you. It's so sad when croissants get left in the fridge and no one eats them. They just sit there all alone, feeling neglected. I was, I was so upset that I had to throw out two croissants last week. I... When I get treats, I save them. I'm like a squirrel. So I save them for special. And then... The special doesn't happen because I don't allow it. And so then I have to, like, throw things out. <laughs> yeah, well, it's like the, but the local grocery store had a, it was like a four pack for two dollars. So it wasn't like a big loss, but it was still just like, no, my heart having to throw out a croissant that went moldy. It was. It was a good deal. It was from the, um, like an IGA grocery store. They have like a, a clearance bakery section. I'm guessing you probably have an IGA type store down there. Wait. Yeah. Okay. It's like a local grocery store. It's a, a franchise, I guess, or it gets franchised, but it's full of lots of like ethnic foods. Like up here, it's full of lots of um, Cuban and Puerto Rican and Central American cuisines, things that I, I don't even know what they are and I can't pronounce them. But they look very interesting. Lots of Jamaican stuff too. Uh, what? No? Did you laugh at them? And tell them to fuck off? I mean, obviously you didn't tell them to fuck off, but... <laughs> like, uh... No. Are you are you sure? That is ridiculous. It's so silly. Oh. Oh, well, this is pretty. Got a little bit of redwood. A little bit of oak and maple. Rainfall is common, not very common. Let's keep going this way. Spring, 18 degrees. Oh, yeah. I 
can hear bees around there somewhere. <gasps> Look how pretty this is. Oh. Except for the whole, you know, hole in the ground thing. This is, I think this is it, guys. I think, I think we found our spot and we've already got building materials here. Look at that! I have this big paved area right here. I have a lagoon and some sandy areas. I've got redwoods and and forests. Okay, so important questions. In 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 what style? Gonna build. Is that brazier functional? No, I think it's just decorative. And she craze with some window panes. Scones. Take that immediately. I do, and they're never functional. I'm, you know what? I have hopes. I'm optimistic. Maybe one day they will be. <gasps> things oh my god pickaxe mold barber surgeon hand ribs A bowl and a bed. Hello, this is Punky Pink Cow. Whoever you are, whatever your pronouns, you're valid and loved by this community. Please yes. take time now to care for yourself by hydrating, medicating, caffeinating, urinating, or otherwise participating in some act of self-maintenance. Yep. Take care of yourself. 
It's true. Punky said so. You gotta go like, yeah. There you go. Put go pee. Thank you, Echo. Thank you, Put Put. Well, but that's okay. It's okay if you have to wee a lot, just make sure you drink plenty too. Okay, so we have some furniture that we can borrow. I should grab, actually, hey. Well, that's good. Shit. All right, that's what I wanted here. Well, I feel like I should use this as the entryway to whatever I'm building. All right. Let's turn that into firewood. Hey. I need no way to throw trash. <sighs> Wait, can I use those as storage? Unusable clutter. Well, kick. This is empty. Oh. And then we're going to do where are these crates out. Oh, that's not, that's like an actual reading book. Bong. What is that? Compost. Hmm. 
ruined basil ad useful for cutting grass i mean i've got two sides but sure It's a, it's a very big sound, like with the resonance and everything. Oh, uh, we don't have space in there. I don't need that one, though. Man, being able to have these storage crates is so nice. Oh, there's sunflowers right here. It was still pretty hot here. We may. Oh, oh. Got a well. Well, well, well. Actually. What's that under there? Oh, jeez. Oh, it was just a weird lighting thing going on there. All right. It's your work. This wall is three thick, right? In some places? No. You know how I just, I just had an ad break and I didn't stand up to take the ad break? Or now I need to pee. So I'm going to take a break. <laughs> I know, and you even reminded me. I'll be right back. Enjoy the view.
Hi, Ravi. I'm old Peter now. I didn't need to go before. Wait. I hate when my phone, like, r changes rotation without permission. Okay, so this is the spot that I've decided I'm going to build at. Lots of trees, water. <laughs> yeah. You're not wrong. No, not at all. Some streamers are really good about it. It de I think it depends what I'm playing. Oh, hey. I can do that now. Oh, here we go. Two more storage crates. That's going to be useful when I'm breaking shit down. Oh. Carrots. Goose. Uh, I don't, maybe? That seems like something that you should avoid. I'm not judging you, but I feel like maybe you should try to not do that. You know? Oh gosh. Well, this seems like a smithy area, don't you reckon? Oh. Well, I mean, it's got lots of hay in it, so I guess it was like an animal buyer or something. All right, let's go check out what's over here. Look at the pretty flowers! Ooh, there's a red one in the middle. Farming in seed, nice. Whoa. What the heck? Goose gooses would be the most feared. This is fascinating. The emeralds, like screen.
There's always like extra rooms off the side of these, like little aesthetic chambers. I mean, this is a pretty good place. There's, I don't know about blue clay. Oh, look at that. You can see where I've been running. I like that. There's blue clay nearby, but there's definitely plenty of red clay here. That's what I need to make fire. Or ovens. Oh. Whoa! There's water down there. That's scary. The mother-in-law apartment, the one that's sealed? I have... I have 13 stone blocks. Do we think that's enough? Oh, sorry, dirt blocks. I don't know what's down there. Yeah. I love my mama and law. Well, we can't all be winners. It took me a minute there. I was like, what? Thankfully, we don't have to interact with his mother-in-law. No, not at all. I'm just not very quick on the uptake today. Genuinely slow. And that was subtle too. Okay, surely 30 bricks is enough. Should I do it? Oh, but it's getting dark now. That, it would be very weird if that were the case. Oh, that's so bloody pretty. Okay. Okay. Just mowing the lawn with an old sword, it's fine.
There we go. Now I have fire. Okay. So. Oh, do we, do we want to go check? Let's throw ourselves into that deep, scary hole. Find out what's down there. Nothing. Nothing at all. Ow. Wait, is this a doobly yet? Excuse me. 32 walnut planks. Taking those. leather boots 8% plus 2 degrees there yeah. oh my god those are cute okay so uh I guess uh... that'll do. Oh, that'll be fun. Good thing to know. Okay. 
and the place is gonna be oh yeah that's not great the a leaky kitchen sink is awful you don't realize how much stuff goes into a kitchen sink until it starts leaking And you have to collect all the water from underneath. Ooh, that's good. Did you get the um the back porch stuff taken care of? You was having to wait for wind and rain to chill out. Bong. How did that work out? Oh, nice. Very good. It's amazing how effective Ooh. something like that is. Like before it was all messed up, I used to just use boiling water on our back path to uh, kill the weeds that were coming up between the pavers I 
Like some you don't need to use, you know, like hardcore chemical things half the time. And dish soap is so useful in gardening for so many things. Like for aphids, perfect. Man, I... Oh, there we go. The main reason I'm making this right now is because I need inventory space. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's uh, but it said like salt and vinegar. There's a reason they talk about you know salting the earth. It's very effective. Actually, we've got to a point like with the, the temperature already where we have to be careful where we like if we turn the hose on, we have to make sure we let it run for a little bit before using it on on anything that it could the heat could potentially hurt because the the water just sitting in the pipe it's hot fast. Oh, I picked up, I've got um, another prescription for Daisy to to put in for soon. And uh, I was looking on Chewy, which is where I get her, her medicine from, uh, to see if I could find something to help with the smell, because she, she can't get down into the pen anymore to go potty. Um... And we can't bring her in because of the incontinence. I just can't. I don't have the uh, capacity to deal with dealing with 24-7 doggo diapers. So she spends most of her time outside. And well, that's how she always has. And we, we go out and play with her and you know, keep her company. Um, but it does mean that she's going to the toilet out there on the wood. And now that the temperature is warming up, it's getting a bit stinky. But I found this stuff that apparently dog kennels use, like commercial dog kennels use. It's like a... I don't know what it is, but it's basically like a... a an, I don't... It would take so much hydrogen peroxide. Um, the stuff that just dissolves in like a gallon of water, and but it's like in a, a large quantity that I've ordered it in. Um, that I'm hoping will will help odor mute it's called apparently it even works to help with skunk smells I don't know what it is you can use it in like washing machines um on wood astroturf like the whole whole i don't know what the active ingredient is you can even use it in carpet cleaners apparently oh here we go uh Oh, 
No, it doesn't say what it is. It just says it's an original enzyme formula. It uses for pet odor such as urine on carpet, carpets, walls, fabrics, skunk odor on clothing. Works great in kennels, dog runs, yards, catteries, animal shelters, and hospitals. Zoos, wild animal ranches, horses and livestock farms. And I'm like, well, that sounds like what we need. <laughs> and it makes up to 20 gallons from one box. So I was like, all right, I've got a, I've already got a sprayer. It's non-poisonous, non-caustic, safe to use around humans and pets. So I'm very interested to try this. and see if it works. <gasps> oh my god, those are adorable. Barista was telling you about them. What was I looking at yesterday? I looking at something with a bunch of baby pigs and I was just like dying from food overload. And like, just like pig toddlers, how they like run around, they have like zoomies, like doggos, and I was just like, oh, it's so cute. I can't. I forgot what I was Oh, I'm making a uh, crucible. I've been enjoying your cat pictures. I don't know, like how much do you need? The thing is, you know, chat here is gonna, it's gonna be like, uh, just do it. One of our fucking cats. Put down a piece of sliced turkey for her, which she usually enjoys. But she sees that I'm cooking. This is like midnight last night. Once I'm onto chili, so I made some chili. And I just popped open a can of black beans. She turns her nose up at the chili and starts demanding the can. The empty can from the black beans so i put it down the ground i'm like you're not gonna like it it's literally just bean juice and she just like she got really stuck into it i think someone's forgotten to tell her how to cat Nope, she's a little tabby thing, little tiny, dainty tabby cat. I, I, I don't even, 
I don't even know what to do with her. She's so weird. She's a strange little critter. What's supposed to do with one leather? The fears. That is fear. Oh, oh! Can I use it to make a slime shot? You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Look at that! This mod's given me a path. Ooh. Skin just started crawling. Do they make a? I make a storage vessel. Uh, right. That's uh, doing something useful, maybe? What is that? Salt Peter. Oh, is it one of those Ryobi ones? I'm looking at, I'm hoping to get a battery operated lawnmower at some point, actually. Just because they're so much lighter. But that's a good idea. That'll get, do some uh, business learning for the little one, too. I've had a, a, a Ryobi weed eater for like the last 10 years. I had to replace it the entire thing once because it was cheaper than replacing the parts. Um, but that just it goes through anything. Like my one of our old neighbors was like, "Can I, can I borrow your weed eater?" <laughs> I was just like holding it up and using it to like trim through small branches and like you name it. Skill saw. Oh, that sounds useful. Yeah, I don't have any other attachments for it, but... Oops. I think 
this here is literally like already set up to be a pet. Yeah, I definitely think that's going to be my next thing. I've sort of mentioned it already to Flint in passing, like... If we want to be able to continue doing... With, with me doing yard work, I'm going to have to get it easier to move lawnmower. but yeah we have a i don't know if it's still there or not but we had a like a factory outlet type place for ryobi like um down well not down the road but like down the coast a little I am. I I made a new I started a new save. Um <laughs> I'm just tossing trash into the well, it'll be fine. Uh, but uh, yeah, I found this really neat ruins here, so I'm just sort of... Clearing things out and making a home for it all. Don't even know. I haven't fully excavated them, so I don't know, like, to, to what. I don't know what's in them, so right now it's very much a team group shelter. Thankfully, I don't have to worry about things trying to eat me. So, you know, that's nice. Here he is. I'm a big fan of that. Oh, I've got enough to make copper. So we found in this one set of ruins, we found four storage crates, a vessel, and I found a over the last couple of like hours just exploring I found a couple of like three sconces so that's nice uh, a little yeah, kind of. A little bit. I 
I know that you shouldn't throw clay down the well. Is it a joined faucet or is it two separate faucets? So my first thought was that it's po I don't know how old the hot water cylinder is um but potentially yeah it could just be some like a little bit of rust or like calcified gunk inside the hot water pipe somewhere or it could be in a, a joint um if the hot water cylinder is old, it could be some rust built up in the pipes. I don't know how old the plumbing is there. We had our water main valve replaced, and after they did that, our kitchen... It's just the kitchen sink. Then I would yeah, I'd check under the... I'd check the... the pipe underneath where it comes up from your main water supply up to the sink and by check the probably yeah so check the 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 like the little metal hose first there's usually like little uh mesh um like a little mesh circle that stops gr grot getting in there. Um, but it could be there or it could be the pipe coming up to the hose. But if it's going everywhere else, then that would make sense. But yeah, after we had our, our main water valve replaced, our kitchen water pressure went to shit. And it turned out that there was just a bunch of like, basically like plastic shavings had accumulated behind the, the the mesh there which is it's doing what it's supposed to do it's just it was working too efficiently if all else fails just pull it all apart And hope you can put it back together. Miss Flint and I don't know shit about plumbing either, but that's what we do. It's okay. We'll just pull it apart and it'll be fine. Yeah. I really love that this is giving the But this building is off by one, which irks irks me immediately. <sighs> Alright, I need to make a shovel. So next priority is a second.
<laughs> Gal be my guru? Oh lord. I'm gonna have to have a disclaimer. Everything is at your own risk. Your mileage may vary. Sorry. Flint, open my door and closed it. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Mac and Chili Mac. Hello. Followed him into his room and he had a chicken bacon ranch sandwich for me. So that was nice. Very. All right. Let's have a little snooze. Make it get up. Perfect. All right. Food acquisition is what we need to get done. This is good. God, it's so greasy as well, though. Okay, first thing I should look at doing. Um. Fish baskets, sticks, and cords. We get some passive food stuff going on. We have a baby oak forest outside our place. Look at these baby oaks! Ow. My left hip really hurts. Bees. Oh, that's awesome. Where did we go? Oh, we went to the flea market on Sunday morning. Not, not as exciting as Pokemon Go, but it was the first time in a while that we'd both been out. Kind of moving at the same time. 
for more than, you know, just to walk around the shops. Bloody hot, though. We didn't have... I can use papyrus as well. It was I don't know if it was just that we were... Like we were too early? It was weird. It was really quiet, but it was still nice to like get up and walk around and... Those pretty mushrooms. I was like... <gasps> Oh, ruins! Yeah, no, that's where I've been building. It's, it's literally... Home and get. oh man, that's gonna be fun. Um, when I did vacuum cleaner sales... One of the, the perks, I guess, uh, was that we would we'd be going to these home and garden shows. Oh, yes. And uh, just being able to like walk around on a break and like get all the free samples and shit. <laughs> there was always like amazing food and like the coolest gadgets and shit. Yeah, I loved, I loved, loved, loved doing the uh, shows. It was like, as a whole, the job was pretty crappy. But being allowed to like, well, not being allowed, but like being invited to go on to uh, do the home shows was so much fun. Especially because I was still pretty young when I was doing it. So there was a lot of sense of adventure. It's... It's thatch, right? Oh, here we go, and we need some vines. Oh, maybe. Uh. area here where it's like a crossover between the redwoods and the the other sort of standard forest is so pretty eco -tong? I look for fine because I oh look his peat yes oh oh that's cool I learned another thing shut 
shut up. Look at that with the butterfly flying around. I'm looking for these fine because they make cordage. Oh, it's a pig. I was like, what is that? Oh, well, you see, Dell, a mama pig and a another pig loved each other very much. Spending all your time in Planet Craft. Well, I mean, that's totally understandable. It's a very good game. The game is really wanting me to make storage baskets and I hate cutting grapes much yeah you've you've been very busy and that just means that when you finally get around to it you're going to enjoy it even more or you might find that after a while you're not really interested and that's totally okay too These pretty mushrooms. tell if it's water or bees or maybe it's raining bees oh those are mushrooms I don't want to eat that that's called funeral bell that does not sound like a good mushroom to eat It's bees. <laughs> I'll I'll save that for Drex. Drex loves eating mushrooms. Jesus Christ. I got you. Got some berry bushes planted. Some trees planted. It's 
some more trash thrown in the well. Well, the nice thing with with Winter Story Mirror is that every time I, I mean, for me at least, every time I start, it's a different experience. So even if you've forgotten what you were doing, it just gives you an opportunity to start something new. Which pond do we want to put in? That one? <sighs> I'm gonna bait it with a berry. It's such a pretty area. See, like, we've got the the redwoods out that way. Oh, you can see them. I'm not, like, super fast with this view. I like the... the in, it's interesting, but it's not, like... Exciting me. All right, so let's, um, Sunny. This is not going to end well for you, dude. I think oh dear I wasn't expecting that to happen oh why am I doing this when I've got a scythe fuck's sake oh that's frustrating Well, is there anything that you can have just as a, a light snack to tide you over? Piece of fruit, some crackers and cheese. It's a toast. <laughs> That's a very good solution. Good job. Oh man, I just remembered the um the ginger preserve I was eating. It was so good. Oh, hey, I've got two acorns. Sorry, oak seeds. Oh, 
And my uh, my my goodies that I had in the kitchen still for my birthday uh, was a jar of ginger preserves, and I was like, "This is gonna be not great." I opened it yesterday, and it was fucking delicious. Like, offensively delicious. How dare it be so tasty. I'm completely ignoring the fact that... Because no one has said anything. That in that corner pit was a critter. Yeah, a, a baby bunny may or may not have fallen in the hole before I put set it on fire. Delicious. I can hear it making noises. Yeah, that's totally what I wanted. Oh dear. All right, that is good. There you go. Alright, so those are cooking pots and crucibles. I really want to eat my sandwich, but it's a bit greasy.
of excited if it's worth trying to excavate in these in case there's like something interesting. This is probably more important things I could be doing right now. Like planting a garden. Looking for red uh, blue clay. What is going on with this place? I don't really have a vision for this place yet. Just wait until I get everything set up first. I feel like all of this needs to be like dug out properly. I've got some berry bushes going now, so that's useful. It was crucibles and cooking pots, so I'll be able to smelt the copper I have. So that will do for, I found a pick, I think we're going to do another pick. Maybe I need to make a bone pick. It's handy. Hopefully it's not the like not the kind of burn that will just like pop up overnight so you wake up all like owie. Need blue clay. Uh, 
Oh, that's a hole. Oh, hey, there's a traitor there. Any coloring that could be play. Maybe up there, but I don't know. It's all the way down the air, all the way back in small. Need the blue clay to do an oven. I do that. And Texas poopy. One, you consider it the cat's chair and not yours? I just had to get some orders in for stuff. Wow, oh, oh, that's lovely. Been two hours. All right. Still do with more food. Where did I put the? fish thing. Nothing in it. All right. Uh, 
Um... Watering can. I don't know if I can do that with the blue clay that we have. Oh, sorry, the red clay. Oh, hey! I can't make an oven out of red. Oh, it's... I think it's the blue that I need for the storage vessels now. I'm so fucking excited to get the swimming pool set up. It's I've been completely just like, eh, whatever. About about having one for years, but now that we actually have one ready to get set up, I'm just like, oh my god, yes. I just need to find a a top to go under it. I need a swimming pool. Just a like a an inflatable sort of above ground pool that Flynn's mum got for me. And other than cooling down. After stream in the evenings in summer, I feel like it'll be really nice to just uh, like take some pressure off my joints. Oh, whoops. But I need to get some sand to like level out the ground a bit. And then a tarp to go underneath the pool so that grass doesn't grow up around it. And make it difficult to mow the lawn. But I was thinking the other day how nice it would be just to float and take all that pressure off my hip joints. It was like, oh my god, that sounds amazing. I mean, it's not like super deep, it's only like two and a half feet deep. But... That'll do. I have to find one of them floating drink trays.
I mean, it's still going to be a few days before we can get into it, unfortunately. I just had a, a thought. I don't know if it'll work, but I had a thought. I'm 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 mentally doing some garden planning here. for thoughts I'm not sure what's going to grow around here because it's still pretty warm I don't know if I've got my chart here like 31 degrees is pretty warm for spring does that need to that needs to be fired right Well, that's lovely. <gasps> Pumpkin seeds and cabbage seeds. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, I have to do ours this week. But I'll be able to do our lawns and then uh Oh, the bunny survived. Good job, bunny. <laughs> Little bunny Jesus running through the fire pit. Oh, no. We're not. <laughs> Ow. Well, I mean, Jesus is kind of a zombie anyway, with the whole, you know, Easter thing.
cooking pot. Oh. Crucible, I think. Yeah. Uh. Where put Maybe I should get one of these with firewood. All right. So we can now have bread and roast oh, soups, stews. Oh, God. All right, let's get these going. Little bunny, I'm not sure of your chances. Wait, I said I had two sickles, right? Did I lose them, or was that on the other side? Nope, they're right here. Chop some grass. Oh, it's so satisfying. I'm not sure what to do with that structure there. Bunny's gonna get roasted again. Removing turf. What's uh, is it like the backyard, big backyard project? Oh, right. 
yeah i don't think there's an easy way of doing that is there you literally just have to like get out there with a, a shovel and like cut it out and dig it out out of freaking berries again Maybe while I have a full belly, I should go looking for copper. If I can make... some shears? And a hammer that would make life so much easier? There'll be enough. All right, well, it's mature onions. Delicious. One serving of hearty onion stew. Yeah, just, uh, just snake on the raw onion, it'll be totally fine. Oak planted. I haven't been this way yet. I don't know what that is. Oh, you mean Walla Walla is in Walla Walla Sweet is in like a, a variety of onion? That's a choice. I mean, I guess some people really like raw onion. 
I can uh, gladly take it or leave it. Preferably leave it there. Oh, is that all copper? <gasps> My tomato onion jam that I make. Are you a rock or all right here let's see if i can get the bunny but then the like the onions are basically caramelized and then you cook the onions Fry the onions and then you cook them, caramelize them with diced up tomato and balsamic vinegar and some sugar. And it softens them and just makes more caramelly and yummy. And it's supposed to be for burgers, but I really like it on hot dogs. It's fucking delicious on hot dogs. It's so easy to make as well. It was one of those recipes that we got for, it was like in one of those HelloFresh boxes and, oh, okay. We, uh, we just keep doing it. Like Flint doesn't really like tomatoes or onions, but I love this recipe and it's so easy. It's basically just a, a quick, tomato chutney that you can do in the fry pan. Yeah, it's it's amazing on hamburgers, but I mean, honestly, I'll eat it out of the jar in the fridge with a spoon. <laughs> I eat it on its own, but it, it is also really yummy on hot dogs. Okay, let's do this. That. Yeah. Really? <sighs> Very frustrating, but sure. That's what it's for, isn't it? We're reading. I can't say you've ever hit up a jar of pie filling, but I can 100% appreciate how that would be delicious. I've uh, 
been given. <laughs> but yeah, but there's other flavor pie fillings. I've been giving Flint shit because he's been hitting up cans of frosty. And I keep on going into the room after a stream and he'll be like, the jar will be on one side kind of hidden and there'll be a spoon. And I'm like, have you been eating frosting again? And he'd be like, okay. Oh, by sixteen. To see if I can find a good price on a top to go under the or if we get The prices on some of these tops are ridiculous. All right, we have ads popping in 30 seconds. Be a great time to stand up, stretch. Get a drink. Look at something so a little further away than you usually look at and uh, I'll be back in a few minutes I'll see you soon
gonna hold off on buying a tile for now. I think we have one. Perhaps it's snuggled on your arm. Aww. Ooh, that filled me up real good. Shit. We no, we can't do that. Mushy onion and turnip stew. All right, I think I can top these off. such a good baby. <laughs> well, he was. those little beans. Ow! He likes the gentle soothing sounds, oh lord. Alright. So we've got anvil watering can and ingot molds. I have a pickaxe mold right here. Oh, and the hammer I sleep on last. I feel like soothing is perhaps, you know, like not quite the right perspective. Whoops. I don't know, it's sick to me now. Need to chop some trees. Held it off as long as I can. Not really. I don't know what's going on there. This looks like a likely tree.
Using walnut for firewood. It's actually, a, I, the amount of people I see posting pictures of cats watching streams, it's like, it's weird. I wonder what the cats think they're watching. I can't remember who it is, but there's someone in Little's Discord and their cat loves watching Little streams. Well, interesting. I mean, understandable. I also love watching little streams, but I was like... You can hear her. Yeah, isn't it curious? Shit. Because it's like, some of them, it's like, it's not even that the they're not passively, like, they're actively, like, watching the TV. Um, one of Mal's cats would watch my streams, but he would be mostly watching the, um, like, the mouse movement and stuff. Buddy. I can't remember what game it was that I was playing, but one of Mal's cats was like really interested in it. Good lord! Uh. Uh. That's a lot of... That just break my egg. I hate it. I think you can use jugs now to move water the way that you can buckets. I think. Like that's really what day is it today? Someone's barbie can't yum. We've got a, a neighbor across the road who 
has a a smoker that he he gets started really early in the morning he does um sells barbecue i guess and like you know like the little sort of portable smokers and he sells barbecue at the, in parking lots and so in the morning sometimes we'll wake up to the smell of like <laughs> slow slowly roast you know like the the warm wood smoke it's fucking torture and also sometimes kind of annoying that is how you stack fireworks <laughs> it's totally fine It depends on the angle because sometimes it'll like just it'll be too much no <laughs> no it's fine i'm a professional wood stacker so i'm curious Hey! Crap! Hey, buddy! I need to just to make it. I can hear more. Oh, yeah. All right, I really need to get some storage containers figured out. I can't just keep waiting for... I didn't so much. Oh, hey, I didn't realize you could convert... hand basket into a storage basket to reach chest these are all thrushes uh of roofing yeah 
I don't know if that's a base game or thing. No, no, chairs. Three chairs. Right there. I don't know if that's a mod or base game. Because I always get to a point where these hand baskets where I just toss them. But they have function? I was I'm always hopeful that, you know, you can like leave something stored in them and then have them on the shelf. It's just looking like cute things. Because all the pawns around here are surrounded by tool rather than cattail. So itchy. <sighs> Read Cheers. Papyrus. Cat tails, that's it, right? I hate cutting reeds. They make me so mad. <laughs> it's just such a tedious process. Oh, you. Mm -hmm. I have a scythe. Scythe, a scythe makes cutting the reeds so much faster. <sighs> nope. Please. I don't know why it bothers me, the reeds. I don't know if it's just like, it takes, it feels like it takes longer than it should. I think it's probably just the action though. Hey little foxy! Okay, I feel better with that. Thank you. 
Like, am I being unreasonable here? Like, one of the things that I liked about living in the jungle environment is that there were... vines that I could use as alternatives for pretty much everything. Um, all right, scythe. All right, have a good dinner. Thank you. No, you. This. Carrots. Oh, it's a big mama tree. There's a bunch of reeds over there. Let's get that. I hear bees. Oh god, that just makes life so much easier. There's a lot of bees around here, considering the seed is not the bees. Maybe that's the key.
I thought that looked suspiciously like a thing. The bees are happy. Oh, until I knock their hives out. Hi. It may be like the best thing about the bees on Valheim. That little message. Bees are happy. All right, that's at least enough for two baskets. These pretty oak trees. More, more bees. We do. Oh, hey. Well, hello there. Oh, my is high fertility soil. There's so many other buildings I could have taken over as a place for shelter and instead I've just made this like... <laughs> I don't know, building apron I guess? I mean, that's true. I'm not really worried about it. But I said everything's in passive mode, so I don't have to worry about things trying to eat my face. Alright, so we've got anvil, ingot modes, watering can. Quasel! Fuck me. Why is it so loud? Because I've got my headset on. Put my headset on instead of my earbuds. Well, hey, you. Hello. Welcome in. Hi, Time Wanderer. 
Ram, that absolutely wouldn't have worked if I hadn't have just pooped myself from another sound effect. Hi, Ram. Hi, Jizzy. Thank you for the raid. Penny's Big Breakaway. That looks like a really cute game. Hey. Hello, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Um, for those of you who don't know me, I am Deliria Odell. My pronouns are she, her, and I'm currently playing uh, Vintage Story. It's very cute, pure joy. Sometimes you need that. Um, don't forget to pick a color. I usually just put you down for dark blue, but any color from the pride flag. We got you. Um, I should just eat these to make room in my bags. I kind of, I kind of got that from, you know, the hair and the nails and everything else. Jesse surprised me and Jesse went with purple. Um, but yeah, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. If if you need to get off and take care of yourselves and the doggos, please don't feel any obligation to hang around. But obviously you're welcome. Happy birthday for Kit! <gasps> Kit! Happy birthday, Papa! Best girl. Happy birthday, Doggo Kit! Hi, Mal. She's 11, you... <gasps> no, that's adorable. Did you get a picture of it? Howdy. We need to get uh, Daisy's 10th birthdays in June. So we have to do something for her for that. Oh, good. I'll be sure to check out the Instagram. For the, uh, the doggo's account. You, a laser pointer that you still haven't lost that's very impressive I've never been one to make a fuss about birthdays for, for critters but Daisy is definitely getting something special for her 10th birthday this year um okay what am I doing she does deserve it and I deserve it too so we've we've taken over a ruin here. Oh, that's really cute, Luna. Oh, this is I wanted to test something. Uh I wanted to test I can do this No It's fine I didn't think I could but I wasn't sure Whoopsie So I'm going to need a jar. Oh, awesome. Thank you. I can't remember if this is going to work or not.
So we're making making stuff out of clay. I guess I can chuck it in here. Um, then you have to fire it. I probably could have put more stuff in there, but I'm not going to bother. I've got some interesting mods in here. One of them is this mod that makes trails. So every time you run over a block, it registers if you've run over it before. And eventually creates this like path. So you can see, like, I've, I've obviously run backwards and forwards along here a few times. And then it starts to reflect on the map. So this is all pathways of where I've been running regularly. And I think it's a really neat mod. And I was going to like tweak some settings, but I decided just to like let it play out and just see what it looks like. Daisy got a, um, a massive bone. We gave her a huge, like basically a cow leg bone on Sunday. And she's been using it as a, a pillar, which is pretty cute. It's a big bone. It's almost as big as she is. It's kind of ridiculous. It's crap. Oh, Mal, this crab. Crab. Crab of the woods is like, don't fuck with me because I will fuck you up. And I'm like, okay. Yeah, no, I don't think so. They, they, they hurt. I'm a little bit worried that I'm going to start a fire, but also like a little bit like just joking, but w what if? should be enough. 
crap. See? He took a third of my health and all I did was run by it. Crap has AoE crap. So this ruin I've like taken over. I've not added any stone. This is just how it was. I've just... Yeah. I've not added any stone to it. I've just thrown my stuff on top of it. You see fire. It's almost done. I actually, I'm really enjoying how the pathing is showing on the map. It's all going to go downhill when these. Um, Moldus decide to walk through fire again. I really need to do something about these holes. get the watering can done and then I can at least get some garden planted. Oh, it's gonna be easier to make a fence out of stone than out of stick. So many of them. Jerks. Out there mowing my lawn. It's so weird having them passive. Right. Funny, please. So now I have a watering can. Yeah, 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 whatever. An anvil mold. Ingot molds. I'm waiting on the hammer. So noisy. All right, so the hammer is done, and then it's just a matter of going off to go and get get another enough copper. To make all the things and I already have 260 units and I have a pickaxe already. I think what I'm going to do is use some of that copper 
to make another pack. Uh, which is here. Buddy, get out of there. There are fire hazards. I can do this one straight away, actually. Excuse me. This, we're gonna end up with a big bloody fire because of these jackasses walking around everywhere. Alright, so that's going to get smelted and go into here, so I'll have an extra pack. And then we can go mining. I don't need food. Ugh, fucking food there. Food is such a tiresome thing to manage. IRL too. Ow. Ugh. Oh look, this isn't even gonna work, is it? The only reason that worked last time is because I had brown coal. Damn it. Good job, buddy. Apparently that's how you make a trip for the a trap for them.
What, are you sad that your friend got cooked alive? Didn't even have anything good. Rubbish, really. Yeah. All right, need a few more bits of wood there. So charcoal pit is going on. That's there. Oh, whoops. Apparently I am hungry. Oh, hey, I should eat that first. Here we go. Well, now I've got... Two hundred there. Get that loaded up. Oh, I'm so glad the um, point redemption is working now. For some reason, at the beginning of stream, it was. Telling people that I wasn't live. So, so. That I was. I was alive. So, so. Yes. Uh, yourself. We're recycling building materials. So keep going that way. Oh, there we go. Alright. 
We have an ad break coming up shortly. Very shortly. Um, so please take this chance to stand up, stretch, and get a drink. Some heat and hydrating. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, how do I do this? Oh, hey, this will be a way to use some of these bricks that I've got. Uh, no, that's not what I asked you to do. That's not a good idea. Just say it. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. Just you know, don't do that. What did I just say? gonna hurt told you that was gonna happen Temporal gear. Mind if I do. All right. That will help immensely.
It's still a weird... Mace of whatever it is going on in here. Nothing else neat. The spinny pits, but... It's done now, I guess. didn't see you there. It's a tree stump. Desperately don't want to fall into that well. I need to do something to prevent that from happening. All right. We've got the charcoal pit going. Twelve hours, and then I can get the copper going to make a pick and a hammer. And then we can head out and try and find some more copper. Food is still the most important thing though, that I'm kind of... But I have a watering can. Should just plant right now. I don't know how many of those seeds are going to work. Also... I need fencing. Because rabbits are little jerks and they're going to try and eat my garden. I'm gonna try and do just a little garden in you over here. Here. I don't know which is. Oh, shovel is faster.
All right, so I need some more. Okay. We're gonna break up some. Okay. Yeah. We had a bunch of boulders. So if you can break it down. Yeah, that's just a ladder of stairs. I've got some wooden fence right here. I don't think you need it somewhere else. Four logs, four sticks on it. Enough there. Very obviously two. about to break. I imagine this would be an interesting mod to have paired up with um one that adds villagers into a single player game because then the NPCs will be making their own parts. I use mixed wood. I bet I can't.
Thanks. Two in the air. Take out the pine tree first, because I don't really like pines that much. Gonna vanish. Yeah, okay. I do like the uh, the leaf debris falling the way it does. Tell me I made a gate. Okay, I did. Oh, that is so gross. Like the color and the mismatch. So we have a secure area. It is bunny proof. No, stop it. Is Mike do okay here? But I'm thinking probably not. Now what I need to do is dig a trench around the outside to try and catch the little shits who want to steal my... Veggies.
I can hear what's going on. We'll see how that goes. Hey, Jer. You there? Shovel. We have rabbit pets. Garden planted. Don't know how much of it's actually going to grow, but that's that done. Like the charcoal is still doing its thing. Four hours. It's almost finished. That's the jug. I don't think the jug is going to work the way I'm hoping it will. That's okay. Cute. Do you have one more ladder? Maybe I should set up another. really differentiate between the tracks that I've left and the tracks that critters have left. Do. 
hit thunder. Here we go. Alright, so we have one jug of water. Wait. I don't think it's going to work. Pretty sure I just hit control the same both times, but yeah, I think I'm actually just drinking it. All right, that's fine. I think we did pretty well for the day though. Some of that is not going to grow. One hour and thirty five minutes. All right, I think I'm going to call it there. Oh, it's been a day. Um, tomorrow is Friday. I think, is it? Yes, we're, oh my god, if he was, I wasn't sure. Alright, so yeah, tomorrow's Friday. Uh, I don't have any fixed plans for the day, so we'll just play it by ear, which I, like I have been the last couple of weeks. Um, we are going to... Raid Ravi, who is playing Echoes of Plum Grove, which might be familiar to some of you. Um, yeah. I'm going to finish my sandwich because otherwise it's just going to go stale. So we might do this tomorrow or something else. Well, thank you for keeping me company. I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed it all. I'm feeling a hell of a lot better than yesterday. Um, but maybe tomorrow I might have a swimming pool. Actually, not likely. Possible, but not likely. All right. Uh, here are the raid messages. If you would like to copy and paste one of those, raid in. Welcome to the going to work for me today. It is going to work for me. Uh, yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a good sleep. Be well, be safe, be kind to yourselves and to others. And I'll catch you next time. Sorry, my ear is really itchy. And I.